Welcome back folks to another episode of Prado 150 out of here. Have you ever wondered how to get your water out of these jerry cans and back into your water tanks in your caravan? Uh, especially when you've got to get them in there under pressure. Well I've got a little thing that might help you guys. It's a very cheap way of doing it. So uh, let's get into it, eh? Well, um, I've just been down at Auto Barn, down at Toowoomba there, and I've got myself a cordless outdoor shower kit for under $90, okay? What it is, it's a cordless shower kit with a rechargeable lithium battery. So just to cheat a little bit, I've actually already charged up the battery, uh, ready to go, so I can show you how this works. Now, um, I had a chat to Auto Barn. Um, we are gonna chop an end off the cord here, so, it may possibly, or I need to tell you, it may possibly void the warranty if anything goes wrong. However, we're not changing any of the mechanical uh, parts of it, just that we're chopping an end off the cord. So just keep that in mind if you uh, want to go out and get yourself one of these. Now, this is a very cheap way of getting water from your jerry can or water supply back into your tanks, okay, of your caravan. Um, because I don't know what yours is like, but mine is, you need it under a little bit of pressure to get the water back in there. So let's start by opening her up. Um, comes in a nice little, little bag that you can see there. What you're gonna need is you're gonna need one of these. This is a, a one of those, um, a, you know, connectors to your caravan. And we're gonna put the pipe from one end straight into here and the other end is going to go into your jerry can and we're going to feed some water out of your jerry can and put it into the water tanks rechargeable battery so at the moment she's all charged up when you get these from you they say charge them up for two and a half hours it just needs a uh, USB, it's a USB connector and it plugs into there uh, it gives you a shower head we're not going to need this so we'll put that aside uh, this is the uh, pump that you drop into the water. This end here goes into your power pack, like so. Oops, so she's uh, obviously turned on, so if I turn her off, so that just goes in there, if you can see that, like so. And uh, we just put that in like so. Just remember, this part here is not waterproof. Okay? We've got a pipe. Now, one of these ends, we're going to we're going to cut that off. We're going to put it uh, in there. And the other end is going to join uh, onto there, which we can do now. So that just goes onto the end there. Very simple. Now you're getting this uh, fairly raw, guys, because I haven't done I haven't done this as a you know tester first. You're getting the test right now. Just some. Uh, you know, clips, if you were going to use the shower part, that's what you'd hang the shower up with. And uh, that's about it. So, get yourself a pair of scissors. We're going to chop this off. Okay, so I don't know if you can see that. We're just going to chop that off there. And we're going to put it onto the end of here. Don't forget to put that in, in there first. Um, I'm a bit of a sloppy chopper so just make sure it's nice and neat okay we're going to put that in there because that's going to fit perfectly just a bit of squeezing we don't want it coming off so um, that just goes in there nicely so that's just your garden hose adapter goes in there now this pumps out it's not very quick it's 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 enough to get you out of trouble okay so it pumps out uh, about two two liters a minute I mean, if you can imagine on a 20 litre jerry can, it's probably going to take you, what, what's that, um, you know, about five, five minutes. The battery lasts um, for 45 minutes before it needs uh, recharging, so there's plenty of, of power. And they also recommend, uh, when you've got this in storage, make sure you just give it a bit of a charge up every uh, month or two. So, um, they also recommend keeping it charged at about at least 40%. That just protects your uh, lithium uh, rechargeable battery. So, well, let's give this a go. All right, folks, well, the first test is gonna be whether this here, so that's your pump end, gonna fit uh, in the jerry can. So let's have a look, eh? We'll just see what happens. So we just pop that in there and look at that. 
So you can put all that in there. So that's the first part of the test. Um, so I'm going to move this over to where I'm going to plug it into the van and uh, we're going to get some water out. Cross the fingers. <laughs> well, folks, hope you can see me okay. Just going to bend down a little bit. So we've got the jerry can here full of, uh, full of water and um, so I've got the battery pack here. So you just got to be careful not to get it wet. So I'm just going to show, I'm going to show you what to do. So you put this into there until it hits the bottom. You'll just feed, feed it in like so. So we, yep, she, so she's hit the bottom. Just got to put this battery pack uh, somewhere nice and safe, but I'll put it where you can see it. I'll put that there. Now, um, this one here, so I'm going to use, I've let some water out of my second tank, just for the, just to show you guys this little experiment. Um, so, because I normally keep these tanks full on my van. So I've just let some water out. We've got a M for mains. T1's the first tank and T2 is the second tank but I know I've let water out of T2 so I'm going to plug that in there like so and I've got the breather on so I've got to turn the breather on so that um, once the water is full it'll start coming out so we get our battery pack here there's a little button on here you turn on so I'm going to just turn it on and I can hear it on flowing nicely just to show that there's water coming out I'm just going to pull this out for a minute and there you go so you've got water coming out so I'm going to put that back in there just clips in there and away you go you just kind of leave it to go and in my case for my van I just wait I'll just put that in a nice safe place over here out of the way so when I, I don't know if you can hear that noise from here but I can hear the air coming out of the breather so that means the water's going in and uh, once it's got enough water obviously it's full the water will start coming out so I'm going to let that go and uh, just basically see how long it takes and uh, I'll come back and let you know when the water starts coming out. Alright folks, I've come back, probably less than five minutes in fact, um, and we've got water coming out of the breather. So that's how good this system is, and uh, when I just have a look, probably about half of that 20 litre jerry can has uh, been used to go into here. So, what, isn't that a great way to get water into your tank on a budget? So, you know, for under, uh, what is it, under $90, um, with a bit of mod modification to this, not by much, You've got yourself a little pump that can pump water out of your jerry can and straight into your caravan tank. I think that is absolutely marvellous. And uh, let me know in the comments if this is something that you guys want to try. Here we go. It's pouring out. You can see it absolutely pouring out there now. So um, I think that's a great idea. I'm going to be taking that on my trip over to WA. And uh, I'm going to have an extra 40 litres of uh, water at the front of my caravan that I can do this to out the back of nowhere. Well, thanks for watching guys. I hope I've provided some good information there on that. And uh, just stay, don't go away yet because um, this video didn't away. It didn't go quite the plan. <laughs> A few mistakes were made, so I'm gonna play them for you now. But uh, thanks for watching guys. See you on the next one. Cheers. Now folks, if you can't have a laugh with yourself, something's wrong, isn't there? Now, I walked away and I was letting this thing go and I was wondering why it was taking so long to fill up. 
and start overflowing here. So make sure, okay, that when you plug your caravan in, you plug it into the actual water tank and not the main speed. <laughs> Howdy folks, well, I'll go through a little experiment I suppose with you to see how this works. Have you ever wondered how, if you own a caravan, how to get your ex extra water from your jerry cans into your tanks off the caravan? Just do that one again. Take two. Welcome back folks to another episode of Well, I've just been down to Auto Barn and they've got these things on sale. So what it is, it's a cordless outdoor shower kit. And it is what it is. Uh, what it So it is what it says it is. It's a wireless shower kit comes with a recharge